Welcome back everyone, the Minecraft server. We're here again today, uh, transporting some frogs. Please don't get stuck here, okay? Um, let's, uh, let's get rid of this. How do we get rid of this? transporting some more frogs because uh, uh, because we're making a uh, frog light farm and for a frog light farm we need to bring frogs to uh, magma cubes and uh, magma cubes spawn in uh, basalt deltas but also in uh, bastions. <laughs> sorry, sorry, trying to do commentary and uh, focus at the same time. The uh, spawn in bastions, uh, specifically treasury bastions, uh, spawning with a uh, specific magma cube spawner and uh, we're in luck because I saved that spawner when I uh, looted that bastion so we're gonna bring our frogs there but the downside is we are we're gonna need all three types of frogs again and uh, I have the three types of frogs at my base or can't seem to find a green one, but it should be there somewhere. And uh, we're gonna have to take them to the spawner, which is quite far in the nether. So I'm just making this bridge safe. Uh, let's make it double high, because frogs like to jump a bit. See just some more blocks, uh, but yeah, I'm, I'm pretty much uh, I said done with the quest for everything for now until the end opens, uh, so we can uh, finally start focusing more on our builds. And uh, I think I'm gonna use the frog lights in my uh, in my base. So might as well make a farm, right? It's, I don't think anybody else has one so far, so let's get to it. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six. There we go. Of course, I lost one already. One, two, three, four, five, six, yes. And uh, the key with these guys is uh, speed. You just gotta run, and they'll fall out. See? I lost one. Okay. Uh, dangerous nether fire wasn't here. So a bit easier. <laughs> lost another one. Get over here. Okay, let's uh, hoist you up here. Let's go get your lost brothers and sisters. You know what? 
let me, uh, I'll come back to you once I've uh, brought all the frogs to the bastion. See you in a bit. Okay, we're back again here. Oh, a bit laggy. Uh, found out it. Escape frog, please. Where did you go? Get over here. Wide open ocean, okay. Uh, let's not go below. Um, let's not leave really burn but like uh, the free of my frogs just as I completed the thing. So, uh, down. I did I So I went into the world because I saw there were the there was a a cold biome relatively close uh, where I could spawn three new green frogs and uh, didn't have to bring them all the way from my base or some other place. Uh, I hatched the initial green ones at uh, the grove at zero zero. I should look where I'm going. But yeah, this is like a couple hundred blocks. I'll come back with you when some at the portal. Okay, we've made it back to the portal. Barely not have hurt these frogs. Get in, boys. There we go. Go to the other side. Yeah, I'll show you how this all works. Get you over here. This little box. Oh, of course they all broke. We should make it noise. Oh, but yeah, we have three of the green ones here, and three of the orange ones, three of the white ones, another green one, another green one. And we need one more orange. Miss Kelsey. Uh, yeah, just I can actually go back because I have a spare of that one. Uh, but you know what? What I'll do first is uh, I'll, um, I'll get a few more blocks, create a bit more of an edge. Um, I think I have blocks in here. Let me check. I'll be right back. Okay, uh, now to activate the farm. We need, uh, we need to close this up a bit. some glass I think so I can grab that in a bit but I left it at your world but uh, these stone blocks they will kill the bigger uh, magma cubes and split them into smaller cubes uh, the smaller cubes will be eaten by the, the frogs 
and then the frogs, uh, they poop out the frog legs, and this will be collected by a hopper minecart that runs here. It isn't running. For some reason. Get running. Ah, because I'm missing a comparator. I see, I see. Okay. Uh, To the overall. Get more missing ingredients. Open up. Get to you. Uh, I gotta try that while waiting. Let's pop in here. Let's see. Uh, maybe some stone here. already brought the redstone out. So I'll need another break and I'll be right back. Okay, I think we're finally ready to unleash the magma cubes. Let's see, let's go lock. Be careful not to mine the spawner itself. Also needs a redstone torch. Ooh, a few. Almost had to go back again. There's a torch here. Now it works, it powers. I have the intricacies of uh, redstone. I'll tell you, I got my. No. I will uh, look up in a second where I got the thing from, the design. In the meantime, we will find where we'll reveal ourselves. Because uh, the spawner has uh, like a particular uh, spawn radius. It's like one block. Above and uh, two block below, or one block below the spawner, and uh, four in every direction. And that, that one spawn is a bit unfortunate. Their blows a bit here. Did you see they fall in? And they'll eventually, yeah, they'll start to shiver. And they'll break into smaller ones. And those will also break into smaller ones. And eventually be eaten by frogs. This should just be an AFK farm. Well, 
let's let's throw this boy in. Or you can already see the first frog lights. It's, it's just it's, come on. There you go. Okay, it was uh, so. I mean, I knew it was going to be a lot of work, but uh, still disappointed me how much work it truly was. Uh, let's go take a look. Because behind all these walls, there's lava, and I burnt myself so many times. See, I already got some of the frog lights. Let's take you home. Uh, let's see, what do we no longer need? There we go. Okay, um... So we got the Verdant, the Ochre, and the Pearlescent. some of these things in the corner but I'll uh, let you look at the process for a bit and I'll look up where I got the design from Designed by. How can they touch me? That's how they can touch me. It's a design by Pixel Rift. That's going to be it for the video. This farm will be freely available for all. I'll put some signs. Uh, put up some signs so everybody can uh, start using it. And uh, I'll see you in the next episode.